Okay, right in Milwaukee here. This is your own private entrance to the apartment. You're the only one with the key. You also have a doorbell here. But you will never have anyone else using this entrance. Except you. You're heading into your own home. Probably one of the biggest living spaces I have seen in this area for sure. Look at that. Huge. One bedroom on this side of the house, and the other two are on the other side. Believe it or not, someone was living here one day ago. This place cleans up incredibly, incredibly well. Oh, pardon the face. Living room back over there. Bedroom number two. Bedroom two and three can wave at each other. Um, here's the closet. We got central air and heat here. Somebody left you an ironing board, stackable washer dryer, I believe this is some sort of water softening device maybe, or a hot water heater maybe, yeah that probably makes more sense. Here's your HVAC closet, which also gives you a little room for vacuum and brew and other stuff in there. Fuse box right there on that wall too.
like a bookcase or something, you can put pantry stuff in, but you might not even need to with all these cabinets. third bedroom which was a little bit tighter but you can still fit any size bed in here has the biggest closet though free hangers smaller bedroom but this place has a lot of stuff going for it in particular this room here this would be heaven for my dog this is a 20 foot long private sunroom um, your, your heat and AC will not work out here but this is still I mean possibilities endless right of what you could have out here so just be extra storage or like you could legit turn this into like a bunch of plants a little lounge area i mean anything you can get a hammock set up a papa shot basketball machine i have no idea but whoever has a better imagination than me will turn this place into a amazing apartment and yes that is a rooftop deck that we are going to go check out this is not private. This is a shared rooftop deck. These are where your neighbors um, live. Two units in this building. They each have their own private entrance. They each have their own private um, sunroom. I'm not sure if you can see through there now. That's the other apartment they're moving in soon. You walk the plank this way a little bit. And we have stairs leading down to go take out your garbage and then this deck area here is all you looks like the previous people had a, a table right here where you can see the rectangle smart idea probably just imagine laying out in the sun out here, sunbathing, throwing parties, having a ton of fun. This would have been an amazing place to live in my younger days. This is, this is awesome. All right, before I get too caught up in the madness here, let's head back in and we'll take another look. This sunroom gets me every time. These gray um, laminate floorboards. So nice. Yeah. Three windows in here too. Like, ooh, possibilities are endless. Strings and lights. Ceilings are definitely high enough to do some fun stuff. Ooh, golf simulator. Ooh, man. Maybe I want to live here. Okay. So let's go through one more time. Kitchen. Bedroom number three. HVAC closet. In unit laundry. Modern updated bathroom. Bedroom number two. Dining room area with very cool um, chandelier light fixture thing. Very cool. 
cool. Living room, huge arched entrance to both of these places. Uh, very, very nice apartment. Living room. Good, uh, newer updated ceiling fan too. I must go check out bedroom one again. Bedroom sizes are um, 12 feet by 10 and a half, 12 feet by 10 and a half, and 9, nine feet 4 inches by 9 feet 5 inches. So that one is just slightly smaller than the others. 